barely live from Television City, the Sunny and Cher Monstrel Show. Come on in here, come on in here. It's, it's a monster minstrel show. show. It's really safe. <laughs> it's really fun. We only want to say hello. <laughs> if you've heard your mother scream, then she'll scream a little more. That's a monster joke set, put you on the floor. <laughs> What has 12 legs, 11 arms, is orange and green and blue? I don't know, but is it busy tonight? <laughs> Tell me, Mr. Moans, do you have a favorite rock group? Oh, yes, 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 I saw them last night. Sweat and tears. Oh, wait a minute, isn't that blood, sweat and tears? Not anymore. <laughs> Tell me, Madam Bones, who was that monster I saw you with last night? That was no monster. That was Sonny Bono. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here's a comedy team that will kill you. <laughs> Stab it and go Stello. <laughs> Costello. Hey, can you tell me the names of the guys in the torture room? Sure. There's a weird bunch down there, you know. They have a lot of weird nicknames. Oh, yeah? Like what? Well, who's on the rack, what's in chains, and I don't know who's in a snake pit. <laughs> yeah, but do you know the names of the guys? Yes. Well, then who's in the rack? That's right. No, no, I mean the name of the guy on the rack. Well, who's on the rack? What are you asking me for? I'm not asking you. I'm telling you who's on the rack. <laughs> Who is? That's right. <laughs> Let me get this straight. Wait a minute. Now, have you got a guy on the rack in the torture room or not? Of course. Okay. But when you stretch the rack, who screams? That's right. <laughs> All I want is a straight answer. What is the name of the guy on the rack? No, 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 no. What is the name of the guy in chains? Who's on the rack? <laughs> you do me a favor. Just forget about the change and give me a simple answer. What is the name of the guy on the rack? Who is the name of the guy on the rack? What is the name of the guy in the chain? <laughs> now, what is it, Costello? What do you want to know? All I want to know is, what is the name of the guy on the rack? Who is the name of the guy on the rack? What is the name of the guy in chains? I don't know. I don't know who's in the snake pit. We're not even talking about him. <laughs> I want the mummy. <laughs> now, tell me, Madam Bones. Do you know the name of the etiquette monster? I certainly do. Miss Emily Ghost. <laughs> tell me, tell me, Mr. Underlocker, should celery be eaten with the fingers? No, the fingers should be eaten separately. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the great Gulo.
but where's the trick? <laughs> the trick. <laughs> Mr. Underlocketer. Yes? Yes, I have a monster with one leg named Morris. Really? What's the name of his other leg? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and ghouls, the hilarious Invisible Man. Hi, folks, this is the Invisible You Can See Right Through Me Man. My wife said to me the other day, Invisible, she said, I don't see what I saw in you. Tell me, Mr. Underlocketer, do you know what's black and white and red? with a stake through your heart. That's not amusing. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, monstrels and victims, the unearthly song stylings of our own ever strange Ms. Vampira. <laughs> that go bump in the night. Listen, you fools, to the goblins and ghouls, to those things that go jump in the night. Graves start to open and corpses sit up, scaring you out of your mind. Chains start to rattle and heads start to roll. These are gears that are starting to grind and to bump and to grind and to bump. Well, I start to bump and to grind. The vampire bats, they are draining a vein just for spice. So knock off the gloom, and we'll jazz off the tomb with the crawlies that clump, and the jeepers that jump, and the bloodies that stomp, and the buggies that whomp, and the things that go bump in the night. Professor, feed his man-eating garden red suspenders. I'll bite. Why does the mad professor feed his man-eating garden red suspenders? To keep his plants from falling down. <laughs> Divine 